What is going on, people? It is your boy, Daddy Mac, and welcome back to a brand new Pokemon Sword and Shield Wi-Fi battle. Today, we are against Sauri. Sauri. Sorry, you guys have to hear me say this. Uh, sorry. But anyways, no, that's enough jokes. Okay, so Sorry is bringing a pretty cool team. Looks like it's mono dark. It is mono dark. So Saval is going to have a field day against this, against my opponent's team. Now, my opponent does not know I am Savali Fairy. Not yet, anyways. So Savali Fairy is going to do good against everybody except for the Ice Sharp and the Incineroar. So we're both packing the Incineroar here. He's probably going to start Grim Snarl. So because of that, I'm going to take the opportunity to take uh, to set up Sticky Web with Galvantula, and then uh, do some shenanigans from there. So we're going to go ahead and start. Galvantula because he's probably gonna set up the screens with the Grim Snarl. Unless for some reason he's running a a physical attacking Grim Snarl, which I highly doubt because Grim Snarl is just not used like that. Only I use them like that. And a couple other YouTubers. Feel free to check them out. But Alright, High Dragon is actually coming up. This is actually new. I was not expecting High Dragon League to be honest, and it's a shiny High Dragon at that. All right, Galvantula is coming in. Do I want to set up? I'm going to set up. I'm not even going to question it. Don't even think about it. Just click Sticky Web. He's probably going to switch out. Hopefully he does. Because Galvantula is a pretty scary Pokemon. Against a dark team, that is. All right, sorry. What are you going to do? What are you going to do? I should have gotten some water before starting. That's okay. It's going to be a quick battle. At least I hope. This... Eternatus theme is pretty cool to be honest. I like this one. I like this one. What are you gonna do? Just click a move. A dragon's gonna go down anyways. Not now, but next turn. Alright, withdrawals. I expected that, to be honest. Incineroar is coming now, who's probably gonna intimidate us. And a beautiful Incineroar. Beautiful Incineroar. Tiny one at that. Not really afraid of Incineroar right now, given I have a Draco in the back. By Draco, I mean Draco Bish. So, let's see. I kind of want an Incineroar, to be honest. An Incineroar of my own. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to go ahead and go sit Incineroar because I'm also running a fighting type move. I don't doubt that he is, to be honest, but I'm just not afraid right now. Incineroar versus Incineroar. All right. What are you going to do? You're going to go knock off. Knocking off my choice band. That is a little bit of a shame, to be honest. That's fine. I'm going to Drain Punch here. He's probably not going to expect this. Okay, we're both <laughs> we're both using Drain Punch. We're going to trade Drain Punches. That's funny, to be honest. Drain Punch. I'm out of my nature. It's about a two-hit KO. All right. Do well, I want to predict a uh, Grimstone on next? Probably not. So I'm gonna, I'm just gonna Drain Punch again. This is awesome. You will never see an Incineroar like this versus a shiny Incineroar. Exclusive to here, ladies and gentlemen. All right, Mandibuzz comes out, also shiny. Hmm, he's starting to get a little suspicious. Drain Punch gonna do a pretty good amount of damage. Not enough. Okay, does Mandibuzz outspeed Incineroar? Probably. Rocky, ah, I was gonna U-turn, but I'm not gonna reveal that just yet. I'm gonna go wishy-washy here. Because it, it, Mandy Buzz can go for a foul play. I don't fear the foul play, if I'm being honest with you. Because wishy-washy is just, I, I'm, I'm modest nature. I don't have full IVs in a defog. So maybe I should get rid of the Mandy Buzz before doing anything else. Okay. Do I, I'm going to Ice Beam here. I'm going to go ahead and go for Ice Beam. I was going to go for a Scald, but it's just not worth it. Go ahead and go Toxic. That's fine. I'm going to reveal to you that I'm running Ice Beam for you. Come on, Wishy Washy. Let's do this. Knock him out. Close. Close, kind of. I wish I froze, to be honest. It's cool because the two darker wishy-washy are like it's uh gills. Do I want to switch? I kind of do. I'm going to hydro pump it in case he switches though. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to hydro pump because 
No, are you gonna Dynamax? Okay. No Dynamax for my opponent. Okay. Can I please land this? Please land this. Okay. Hydro Pump. Okay, awesome. That's a lot of damage, but not enough to knock out. So he's probably gonna try to stall me with that, uh, with that Roost, and that's fine. So what I'm gonna do is go back into Galvantula, and I'm gonna threaten this thing with a Thunderbolt. Turn Wishy Washy. You ain't gotta be taking a whole bunch of toxic damage like that. Roost again, I thought so. I'm really not afraid of anything in his team. I should be, but I'm not. I'm gonna Thunderbolt here. I really like that little, like, whistle thing. Alright, withdrawal Mandy Buzz. You're gonna go into Bisharp, right? Incineroar again. Okay. That's fine. Incineroar doesn't scare me. I'm faster than Incineroar, that's for sure. Unless you're Choice Scarf, which you're not. Because you used Knock Off earlier and it hit me with a Drain Punch. That might be Assault Vest. I, I think that's an Assault Vest Incineroar. So what I'm going to do here is Thunderbolt. I'm not going to switch into my own Incineroar. You're going to Fake Out. Okay. Okay, so what I'm going to do then is switch into my Incineroar. Might as well just like have him take some damage. He's probably going to predict that. And that's okay because I really want to intimidate this thing. And then I'm just going to come back in and hit a, a Drain Punch. Flare Blitz. Shouldn't have. Shouldn't have. Yeah, that's that's some damage. Better than none. This is still a close battle. No one has gotten knocked out yet. I think I'm going to be the first, to be honest. And Sinor, please take this. Not you. But me. Withdrawals? Okay. Probably Mandibuzz again. I thought so. That still has a lot of HP left. I didn't... I, I thought it was in red for some reason. Okay, Drain Punch. That's a lot of Rocky Helmet damage. Um, I really don't want to hit this thing with anything else. Because it's just going to roost it off. I kind of want a Vicious Ren, to be honest. Stone Edge might be a move, too. Possibly multi-attack. I have a lot of I have a couple options here. I'm gonna go Galvantula. I really can't afford to let Galvantula go down though. Am I running U-turn on my Galvantula? Why am I not running Bolt Switch? What is wrong with me? Oh wait. Sticky web, energy Okay, I'm not running U-turn. I'm dreaming. Ignore that. Ignore what I just said. Alright, I'm gonna go Thunderbolt again. Because this Mandy Buzz is getting a little bit of an annoying. That's some good damage right there. That's what I call damage. Foul play, that's fine. You're probably gonna switch, question mark. I'm just gonna Thunderbolt. I shouldn't risk the switch. Because this thing is a wall. I need to knock this thing out if I if I want a chance at winning. I just noticed Mandibuzz has a birthmark. Go ahead. Incinero comes out. Incinero is gonna go down more than likely. I mean, you can fake me out. Can't fake me out, but after that, what are you going to do? Incineroar goes down. So my opponent is the first one to go down. Again, still anybody's battle. Given that my Pokemon, not all of them, but some of them are pretty weak. And I got my Wishiwashi who's toxic. Who's poison is the correct term, not toxic. Um, what are you going to do now? I mean... Given that he has, that she has a, a mono dark team, it's, you, you gotta be very skillful when using a, a mono dark team, and anybody who uses a mono team, I respect you, because I wanna try running a mono team, but I don't think I can. I, I, I mean, I'm pretty good at competitive battling, but I really don't think I can, I, I can build a mono team. Alright, Bisharp comes out, perfectly fine, you're probably gonna want to knock me out. Um, I'm gonna Sticky Web. I'm going to Sticky Web. Okay. Lord's Dance. I'm scared now. I am I am scared now. 
Can I switch Incineroar? I'm, Gavantula is still valuable to me, given that it's a bug type. And it's, uh... And it's Sticky Wet. And it's electric because of the Mantle Buzz. I'm gonna go Incineroar. Lower this... It's defiant! I just realized that. I messed up. I messed up. That might that might be the battle right there. I don't have any priority. Okay. At least there's that. Probably gonna want to Sucker Punch me now. So I'm gonna switch out. What resists the Sucker Punch? Nothing. Nothing. Nothing resists the Sucker Punch here. <laughs> the trio and hit my own Sucker Punch. Should I? I kind of want to play the mind games a little bit. All right, I'm gonna switch out. He's probably gonna try to click Sucker Punch again. I thought, I thought so. Okay. Now what I'm gonna do is Sucker Punch myself. Okay, I hit. Is he gonna try to Sucker Punch also? Imagine if he does. Ha! That is hilarious. My games are done. I'm gonna Earthquake here. <laughs> That's really funny. Doug Trio uses Earthquake. Way to play around this by Sharp. I'm really proud of myself. I was not expecting for Sucker Punch to work like that. I learned something new. I hope you guys did too. Smack that like button if you guys learned something new. And by the way, if you guys haven't checked out the, the team builder, be sure to check it out. If you guys don't know how to EV train, check out my last video. Or that's actually uploading Monday. What am I saying? Okay. I'm going to switch out. Wishiwashi, I'm gonna switch out into Wishiwashi. I think that's a good move for me. Switch out into Wishiwashi. Because Alola and Doug Trio is still pretty good against the. What's that Pokemon's name? Against the Grimmsnarl. Substitute. Pretty good read. That's a pretty good read, I'm not gonna lie. You're gonna nasty plot next, aren't you? Get a nasty plot next, ladies and gentlemen. I honestly don't know what to do. I'm gonna ice beam. Nasty plot? Yeah, I thought so. I thought he was gonna nasty plot. I, I forgot I dragon has nasty plot. And that makes it a really scary Pokemon. So I'm gonna ice beam here. If my opponent wants to do Nasty Plot again next turn. I'm honestly just going to go to uh, Dracovish and try to get him with a... What's that attack called? Um, ra uh, Rush. Dragon Rush. Why did I forget? They're probably going to attack me now. And I'm honestly scared. going to attack me now, aren't you? Come on. You know you want to. Dragon Pulse. We're living. We're we're still big. This is good. I just missed the knockout. For a second there, I thought we were going to outspeed. We're going to go down here. All right. So now what I'm going to do is go into Dracovish because I should outspeed. At least I think so. I'm going to go Dracovish here. And instead of going for... Dragon Rush, because it has a really good chance to miss. I'm going to go for a... Huh. Vicious Ren, then. It'll knock out. It'll knock out. I'm not afraid of this thing not getting knocked out by the attack I just called, because it was. As you can see. Alright. I'm not thinking two steps ahead of my opponent. I don't know why. I, I usually do. I just... Don't know what my opponent's gonna do. Grimmsnarl. That's understandable. That's really understandable. I'm not gonna stay in. No way I'm staying in here. I kinda want to, but no way I am. I'm gonna go Incineroar here. It's okay if Incineroar goes down because... Because of the... Intimidate. That's it's It's worth it for me. Especially if this thing has weakness policy and Dynamaxes. Alright, Thunder Wave. Doesn't affect me? What? Why? 
Is it prank? Is it because it's prankster? Possibly. That's probably it. Drain punch or flare blitz? Think of the long run. Think of the long run. Just drain punch right now. Reflect. That's fine. That's fine. Go for that. I'm going to drain punch right here. What other Pokemon that are scary is does he have in the pack? In the back. Obviously, Mandibuzz. I ran it sorry as a scary bon as a scary mon. Brain punch one more time. I think I should. I, I honestly think I should. I'm gonna go Doug Trio here, actually. I'm gonna go Doug Trio, given that if he switches Mandibuzz, I have the rock slide for this or the stone edge. If he stays in, I got an iron head for it. If he goes to Iranitar, I'm going. This is weak. Okay, good. I'm okay with this, to be honest. I'm 100% okay with this. I'm not gonna do a contact move because I'm gonna Stone Edge and you're gonna land. Stone Edge and it lands? Perfect. What? No way. Oh my goodness. It's because of the reflect, isn't it? It's because of the reflect. Galvantula just got way more valuable for me. I kind of want a Dynamax. But I don't know if I should yet. Do some HP. Gonna go for a Roost. You're, I, I should I... I think I should let Doug Trio go down though. Yeah, I'm gonna let Doug Trio go down. Can go for another Stone Edge. I'm just gonna keep, st uh, keep uh, Stone Edging you. Galvantula just became more valuable to me. Reflect is still up, right? Reflect has to be up for eight more turns or three more turns. Not eight more turns, three more turns. All right, Stone Edge again. Get a crit. One of these has to be a crit. Foul play? Fuck, okay. Understandable. I don't think I need the uh, sticky web anymore. No, I really don't. I'm gonna go Stone Edge. I'm really curious as to why Thunder Wave didn't affect me. I really think it's because of Prankster that doesn't affect Dark types. But that's not a reason for Thunder Wave to not hit, right? Can't be. I'm gonna go for a foul play here. And then I'm gonna go into my Galvantula. Beautiful, that's what I was wanting. All right, Galvantula. And then I want to Thunderbolt. I really do. I think I should just click Thunderbolt no matter what. Or should I predict the switch? I'm gonna predict the switch here. I'm gonna go into Neuron. We're gonna we're gonna try to make a prediction here, and hopefully it doesn't bite me in the butt. I really hope not. Galvantula switches. Hopefully my opponent does too. And Cinderor comes in. This is a long battle. You're not switching out. Are you? Foul play. You're not switching out. That's fine. I, I kind of played myself there. Reflect wears off. Uh, Drain Punch is still worth it to me though. I'm going to switch into... You know what? I'm going to the valley. I'm going to the valley. I haven't I haven't used my Soul Valley. I think it's time. Go ahead and roost. Since the battle has three minutes remaining, I'm honestly just gonna Dynamax. Big boy! Alright, it becomes a max strike. I don't want a max strike. What happens if I multi-attack? What happens? That's some damage. That's what I'm talking about. That does a lot of damage because of the Rocky Helmet. You toxic me, that's fine. You're going down next turn. That's all that matters to me. I don't mind being po I don't mind being poisoned right now. I really don't. I'm gonna multi-attack. It should knock you out. 
if you switch it'll do a lot of damage to one of the pokemon you switch into it's gonna it's gonna you're gonna cry don't do it don't do it you i i warned you you're, you're not gonna take this yeah i told you i told you hopefully we can do the same to tyranitar hopefully 60 60 seconds i think i want to be honest tyranitar comes in beautiful shiny Okay, I'm gonna click multi-attack and hope this knocks you out. It knocks out. We go we won. We did it. In the final seconds, we won. That's this was a good battle. We've been recording for less than this because I, I pressed record earlier for about 19 minutes. 22 minutes total, but 19 minutes for you guys, about. About. Come on, just send out Mandibuzz. Don't stall. Just click a button. You can Dynamax if you want to. Just click multi-attack. Don't stall it. All right. You're gonna... Okay, multi-attack, and I won. Knockout! We literally won in the final seconds, and we dominated. I was gonna say it's a close battle, but no, I dominated. I mean, uh, it took me a little bit of uh, brain juice to do it, but we 4-0'd uh, Sorry here. Sorry, thank you so much for that battle. I really hope you come across this video one day. I'm taking a lead card because your team was really cool. If you guys like this video, be sure to leave a like. If you guys think my opponent could have played better, let me know in the comment section down below, and also let me know who the MVP, most valuable Pokemon of this battle was. Last but not least, subscribe to my channel for more Pokemon Sword and Shield Wi-Fi battles. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys next time.